Hassan Halaf, champion for Morocco's handicapped. Making a difference in your world. In the foothills of the Atlas Mountains, the ancient Moroccan city of Demnat is a gateway between the agricultural plains to the north and the Sahara Desert beyond the mountains to the south. Much of the commerce that passes through its gates has changed little in more than a thousand years. But some of the thinking in Demnat is changing, thanks to Hassan Halaf and the Atadamun Association for the Handicapped. I grew up in the city, but for handicapped, we didn't used to see a lot of them. You rarely see one, two or three. And what we said, what we thought is that handicapped children didn't used to exist in Demnat. Halaf runs community outreach programs for the center, where 40 physically and mentally handicapped people between the ages of 5 and 28 get the education they've been missing. All the time they were kept at home. They didn't have access to education. And all of them were illiterate. Now, after and thanks to the monitresses, they are able to read and to write and even to practice other types of activities. The center is almost entirely funded by the French branch of Catholic Relief Services, but it also generates income through the sale of crafts made by young adults learning a trade. Hayat Ben Mumad used to sit at home all day. She says the five years that she's been coming to the center have changed how she sees Demnat and how Demnat sees her. I am not only meeting people here at the center, but while I am walking home too. And that has helped me make more social contacts. Hassan Halaf says the center has increased the visibility of handicapped people in Demnat, making people reconsider their prejudices. Their views and their attitudes have changed and consequently their perception. So they say, they started to say that handicapped children should be taken into account as a part of the community. It's no longer see, they no longer see handicapped children as marginalized. Alaf says his work at the center has broadened his sense of community. As a Demnati, someone born who grew up in Demnat, I say to myself, somewhere you've got a duty towards this community. You've got your job, you studied here, you have your own family, so you should contribute something as a citizen. Hassan Hala says the challenge now is to establish a follow-up program for young adults who need advice and credit to help establish and finance their own businesses. Scott Stearns for VOA's Making a Difference in Demnot, Morocco.